Okay guys, so next up I've managed to find this nice shiny Batten 55mm padlock. As you can see there, beautiful little padlock actually. Uh, it's got a 55mm body with an 11mm hardened shackle, so all in all, not too bad at all actually. Um, it's got the uh, Bulbarian locking system there, so of course a nice secure padlock really. Um, and to pick it, of course, we're going to use the new Sparrows Distortator pick that I recently got yesterday. Obviously it took a little bit longer to get here than I expected, but it got there in the end. And obviously with the current situation out there, it's hardly surprising. But yeah, this thing is absolutely brilliant, I must say. Um, very, very nice to feel. Um, really nice sort of build quality. The only change I've made, let's just move that key out of the way. Um, the only change I've made, I've just changed the picking tip there for one of the um, injector pins. Um, this has got a 0.5 mil picking tip on it, whereas I, I'm used to using a 0.3 mil picking tip. So of course, but all in all, it's absolutely fantastic. Well worth the money. Um, to pick the lock, obviously we're going to rotate the disc clockwise as far as they will go. And of course, as you can see, we've got a removable core there. So once we get it picked, I'll show you all the discs inside. Of course, to pick the lock, we're just going to tension off of disc number one. Make sure our pick can go through nice and easily there. So of course, we're tension off of number one. So of course, we'll be looking to pick from number two. Okay, number two, nothing on two. Disc number three. Nice little click out of three. Disc number four. Little click out of four. Disc number five. Nice little click out of five. Disc number six. Nice little click out of six. Just going through the disc that nice and comfortably. A little click out of seven. Nothing out of eight. A nice little click out of nine. Ten binding. And ten openers up. So not actually too bad at all, actually. It just shows you just how good this uh, this detainer pick is, if I can get it out. Okay, that's the Sparrows Disc Detainer Pick. Works an absolute treat. As I said, we can actually remove the core. So what I do, I just take this little cap off and I'll show you all the discs inside. guys so as you can see we've got a lot of discs there obviously that's the uh, the disc uh, carrier there we'll just fit it to one side um, so obviously this is the uh, the top spinner which obviously has a gate both sides obviously depending on which way the spinner is orientated and then of course we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve discs god dear our lord so I must have tensioned off of the top two discs then inadvertently um, and, uh, and obviously they must have just probably been zero cut, but obviously as you can see there, they are the same cut. Um, and then obviously I started pick, picking off of disc number three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And then obviously 11 must have been a zero cut as well. But yeah, all in all, not a bad little padlock actually. Um, obviously, as you can see, no false gates, um, which is a little bit of a disappointment. Obviously, if it had, had false gates in, it would have been uh, a little trickier to pick. But all in all, not a bad little padlock actually. And of course, the uh, Sparrows Disc Detainer pick made short work of it. Listen guys, hope you enjoyed that. And of course, I'll be up with another video very shortly. Take care guys.